Hey guys, it's Woos the Collector coming from the Wondrous Woos Collectible Cave. Yep, I uh, had the week off. Uh, like I said, um, had some um, health appointments. So while I was out, I did some brick and mortar hunting. So I'll show you a couple finds I got. I didn't go too crazy. I found some stuff here and there, but you know me, I don't like paying full, full price. Um, I did pay full price for a couple things just because I thought... It would um, be hard to find, so I found them out in the wild. I figured get them. Um, as TV goes and movies, watched nothing this week. That's right, because I stayed into the wee hours of the morning to try to get that down. Now, if you saw piles from the other videos, those the piles were huge. And there's a, a there's actually an, a row in there, an aisle now, where I could walk. And I plan to have this done in a, another... Uh, couple weekends hopefully depending on what's going on um, Easter coming up in a couple weekends but next week I am going to see Dungeons and Dragons um, the new movie something about thieves I don't remember the the, the, the full title I've seen the previews uh, Chris uh, Pratt is in it not Chris Pratt Chris the other Chris there's too many Chris's in action movies Chris who was uh, James T. Kirk in the newer ones Chris Pine <laughs> he's in it um don't remember Michelle Rodriguez is in it so she's cool um and there was uh, a couple other oh Hugh Grant so it's got a good cast we'll see what it was Amazon did have a 2 p.m. Um, showing last Sunday but I, I, we opted that we wanted to go see it in XD so that's where we're going next uh, next Saturday is to see it in XD the weekend after that is Easter, so I have to, family obligations have to go and take care of those. So, but we'll do a show probably Easter Sunday because I plan to be home. And our family, um, we celebrate Easter on Saturday because we're all lazy and don't like to leave the houses on Sunday. Um, so yeah, a couple weeks we'll see what's going on. Hopefully, I'll get that pot the piles down. Um, do the unboxing videos. I do have one that uh, I have to get ready for you guys for the Yoda, the child in the chair. Um, but we'll go from there. But let's show you what I found out in the stores. Um, I was able to find uh, Batman out of the three. I did not find Superman. So I've got Dark, Dark Side and um, Dark Seed and um, Batman from the first round, uh, $5. So didn't pass that up. Found another of, I found the, the Zombie Scarlet Witch on clearance at Target, $12.49. So now I have to still just have to get Agent Wu and Howard the Duck. Um, hit a few targets. One target wasn't marked down at all. Um, all the rest were, but it was already stuff I already had. So that was one of our local targets. Um... Lady Woos went and picked this guy up from Best Buy. Um, if you remember last week, I opened up him. He was bent, and there was a Thor. Um, I decided to return them because they were. I paid twelve fifty for them, so that's half price. And I didn't like the conditions they were. So uh, order, drop those off. You can order new ones to deliver to the store. And the Thor one was just as bad as the one they sent. It could have been the same one for all the hell we know. Um, <laughs> you know, I could see them doing that. But it's wrong. But that's why I reordered and shipped to the store and still got a bogus one. So Best Buy, it, it's a crap shoot there. It's kind of like GameStop is a little better, but their shipping can be bad too. The guys just handle stuff bad. I think the guys in stores who do the packing from their stores are a lot better. And then some people just don't care. But yeah, so I got the group for $12.50. Um, FYE... Um, I stopped that one I've been wanting to. Um, the main reason was they had uh, buy one, get one free. So these were two I exclusives I never got. So um, $5 a piece. Couldn't beat that. And while I was there, I needed the Burning Godzilla <laughs> exclusive. He glows in the dark. I paid 15 for him. So for... Um, it's, it, it, it's a crapshoot, especially with the FIE pops. If you wait long enough... They're just so mass produced, you can get them marked down. But there's not too many FYEs here left in um, CT. So I, when I get a chance, I go. So I stopped at a CT. Um, I did hit a Hallmark too, just to see what ornaments I can come up with. I did find um, 
just uh, Scotty. I don't have any of these, so I, I picked them up. 75% off of 39. He was like eight bucks. So well worth it. Also, we went out to our local Walmart to do some grocery shopping, and I found these two. I had to get them. So we got uh, the man, one of the Mandalorians, Axe Walls, and Grogu in the prom. So I, I had to. I they're just they were too good to pass up. Yeah, so I paid full price for these. Um, I did want the Grogu, so I, mean, I threw this guy in just because he looked he cool. He looks cool. <laughs> the sculpt is great on him. Oh, put him in a... <laughs> yes, the backs. So, I picked up those guys from my local Walmart. I did get one shipment from Amazon, which I got in here. It was just having me on the top. I opened it because I thought it was um, personal stuff. But uh, it was a preview pop. I had delivered. Um, I believe this is another Walt Disney one. Sorry, I wasn't prepared to do an opening box. I thought I had everything out. Um, very careful with this because we don't want to ruin him. I think, yeah, this is a Disney one. Walt Disney himself. I think these are going to go up. So that's why I picked them up. This one has um, Dumbo and Timmy plush, Walt Disney. So um, I'd suggest picking these up if you can. I think they're gonna they're gonna be worth something someday. But that's my opinion. Take it or leave it. All right, stopped at my local GameStop because I had to use my five dollar Game Pro Reward Member coupon, and I've already got um, Count Dooku. But now I got Darth Sidious. I just need Vader, um, Oppressed Savage, and um, Darth Maul. So we picked him up. Got two more here. Um, Guardian of the Galaxy ship. Um, this is Walmart exclusive. I have Mantis. I think I picked her up for seven bucks at one Walmart. I, I found these two at another Walmart for five dollars, but the boxes out all of them were. Um, shot but the walmart I, I actually bought these two was before i found the five dollar one um and i picked them both up for 10 so and these were 29.99 so not a bad find for uh clinic clearance um unlike target clearance walmart clearance is hit or miss per store um sometimes you can find the same stuff on clearance but i think it's something to do with the managers put stuff on i i really don't know how the walmart works Target's a little more easier to understand because a lot of people, they, they, they do the same clearance mostly in all the stores. So if you search the DCPI number that I always tell you about, which is on your, um, where'd she go? Right there. Let's see if we can get a little closer. You search that number in their system and you can pick up um, what stores they're located at, and sometimes you can find the prices. That's how the scalpers get you and get most of your thing, most of the good clearance. I've seen people in the stores just looking up stuff on clearance and then taking it all. I hate that. Get a real job. I have a real job. I understand we all have to do some things, but that's doesn't seem fair, I guess, to me. But first come, first serve. Um, and I guess if you need to make money, you do what you have to do. But it sucks for other people who are looking for a deal, too. Well, that's it for this week. I'm going to say we're going to close it all with just saying I'll see you next week. Um, I'll let you know how Dungeons & Dragons is. Um, NXT, Cinemark. Other than that, this is Woo's the Collector signing off.